Hey guys, Tech Ninja with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your flashlight if it's not working or it's grayed out from the control center here. As you can see, if you press and hold, your flashlight light should work just like that. But for some reason, if you're not able to use your flashlight, let's look at why that might be and how you can fix it. So first thing first is, if you're having that issue, make sure your phone is at least charged 20% or more. Sometimes when it's under 20%, it reduces certain functionality and it could be impacting things like flashlights. So first thing is to check by pulling up top that you charge it above 20. Just a quick thing to check. And the next thing you want to check is if you have a case or something, make sure the case is not blocking the flashlight sensor. There are some cases sometimes that cover it because of the way they're designed so make sure it's not the case as well again simple but effective thing to check and then the next thing you want to check is that your phone here now it doesn't it isn't too hot or too cold and this happens let's say if you're in, if you put the phone on the sun or if you put it in a place that is very cold the phone starts to kind of activate the sensor that disables some functionality things like flashlight and a quick way to check if there's an issue going on with it being of that you can open up the camera app so if you go in and locate the camera app here on your phone which you can just pull down search for camera or find it basically open up the camera and you will see an error message right here where it's crossed out or something so you can click on the flash here right if i click on flash by pulling it up and i hold it it should allow the option but for some reason the options are showing up or it's crossed out that means the phone was either too hot or too cold you simply have to just wait it out till the temperature returns back to operating normal temperature again something to kind of keep in mind now if you know it's all of that are good so far the next thing you can do for troubleshooting is doing a nice force restart which will kind of go ahead and give the phone a nice reboot now this will not delete any apps or anything or photos videos or any of your personal information it's pretty simple to do what you'll do is press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down and then hold the side button. Now if Siri activates, we weren't quick enough, so press and hold the volume up, volume down, and then hold the side button. As you can see here, I'm going to hold that side button on the right hand side. I'm not going to slide to power off, just wait till the phone goes completely black. And when it goes black, you will see after that the Apple logo reappear and then I'm, I'm going to let go of that button right here. So as you remember, you want to do volume up and down really quick. Just press and release them one after another and then hold that side button until the screen goes black. As you saw here, if you didn't do those too quick enough, the Siri might activate. So make sure you press volume up and down really quick and then that side button. And once you're back on your phone, go ahead and unlock it by your passcode and pull down the control menu here and hopefully flash is working for you again. But if it's not working, uh, the next thing to do is go into settings here and this time we're going to look for control center and then the control center as you can see here control center is this setting page or menu that you get you see flashlight is there let's go ahead and remove that by clicking on that icon we're going to remove it and now pull down flashlight is gone and then you come down here this time we're going to re-add that flashlight back on so as you can see here we're going to look at this here and then flashlight right up here click that plus icon in green flashlight comes up pull that down as you can see we should have a flashlight available for us and hopefully working this time now if you're still having issue it's time to go ahead and check your phone settings uh, to make sure your phone is up to date with the latest version so to do that you're going to go to settings general software update and you'll see here it's going to load like this if there is an update available like for example at this time of recording the video there's a 16.3 out we're going to simply hit that download and install and update to the latest version. It's always good to update your phone to the latest version. If there is a previous update or some sort of bug fixes affecting your phone's functionality, hopefully it will resolve it. Remember, if you do this, this is going to take somewhere between half an hour to 45 minutes or even up to an hour, depending on how good your Wi-Fi or cellular connection is and how big the update itself is. So you have to be patient with this one. And after you have done that and it's still not working, the next thing to do is go into uh, settings, general, and then all the way down here where it says transfer reset iPhone. You're going to click on that and then the first reset option here that comes up and click on that. And the reset that we want to do is the first one, which is reset all settings. But before you do that, a couple things to keep in mind. This will not delete your photos, videos, apps, or any personal data. What it will remove is things like network settings, like your saved Wi-Fi or VPN settings, your keyboard 
uh, dictionary if you have that home screen layout any sort of a location and privacy settings that you have customized or set itself so keep in mind that although this will not delete any personal data it will kind of uh, set all of your settings back to the default in it and it takes about two to three minutes but it's one of those last resort things that you have to do if you can get flashlight to work and that's it for all of the tips that we have for you guys hopefully now your flashlight is working and if it's not working it's most likely that your flashlight here has a hardware issue in that case you'll have to take it to authorize apple retail store or authorized repair shop that knows how to you know take a look at the hardware or the flashlight itself so hopefully you guys found this video helpful if so please make sure that like and subscribe button and we'll see you guys in the next video and if you guys found a better way to fix this issue make sure to share with us by leaving a comment in the comment section thanks for watching guys see you guys next time